today we're going yeah, to yeah. measure the pi with a pendulum. Surprisingly enough. We have a pendulum which is hanging really high up in the ceiling. There it is. And the length of the string is how much? Uh, it's 245 centimeters. And why? Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you why. Oh, uh, you're going to explain that later. Okay. So basically, uh, even standing over here, you should probably um, stand like that, maybe. Uh, so basically, uh, I, I have a mark over there. Okay, we're going to when track it past, when it goes past it twice. When the pendulum is going to make a complete swing, and that is passing this paper twice. That is a complete swing. And so I, I also have a stopwatch. Okay. Uh, I just I will tell Neva to um let uh, go. Let the pendulum swing. Set set the pendulum swinging when I start the stopwatch. Okay. And uh, I'll stop the stopwatch. Stop the stopwatch when I am uh, when the the pendulum makes ten swings. Oh, okay. Он десять раз должен туда обратно. Он тебе скажет старт, и тогда ты должна отпустить. All right. So three, two, one, go. Don't touch it. Не трогаем его. Now you stopped it. Great of an estimate for pi. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's one round. Okay. <laughs> that great of a, if I, if, uh, that's because I, I put that. Yeah. But what are we counting in? Is uh, this is second. This is second. And basically, uh, if I move that decimal place over. So yeah. Can, that's 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 our pi. Well, it is. Look, you should. Round it up to one because it's sixty-eight. Nope, I'm counting three decimal places. Oh, okay, so it's gonna be three comma zero six eight. Yeah. Well, it is three. All right, so it's let's, uh, almost we're, successful. We're going to try again. Нев, попробуй чуть-чуть подальше его запустить посильнее. Он слишком. Да, и посильнее так его качни. Okay, we're gonna try again. One more time. Oh, this is much better. Nope, actually, I, I've hit, I hit, I've hit stop. Too the, late. Too late. So we have to do it again. No, we have to do it again. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Не в сильнее качни так прям от себя так толкни. Давай. Okay. Three. Так чтобы он подальше отлетел туда. One. Давай, толкай его.
Okay, we're all the time getting a value of... Well, it's not that bad. It's it's almost three comma one. <laughs> I coming. Let's let's just see the theory behind it because I really want to explain want to what we're doing. Uh, can you, you know what? can you come here? Wait, can we go over here? Okay. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do this one more time. One more time. Нет, раз. Отсюда отпусти okay. и прям толкни его. Или я хочешь я сделаю? Okay. Только отойди отойди чуть чуть не выся. Отойди чуть чуть. Okay, I'm going to do it now. Uh, uh, Say when start. Uh, maybe, maybe moving uh, this a little. Yeah, like okay. That. Okay, so. Say when. The finest way I can do. The f okay. Yeah, okay, the final way. And the finest way. Three, two, one, go. One. You wish you could not cry, my sweet. Все хорошо. Three. Oh, no. Why? Yeah, because I, I forgot to hit reset. So. Oh, okay. It went, it went on. Okay, we do it one more time. Yeah? Just say when. Say when. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> that was too high. I actually like the first values better. They were closer to pi. I think the second value was better. <laughs> let's go let's go check out the theory. Because you already prepared on the whiteboard. This is something something you learned from No, go ahead, come here. From because a we, Simon. Mat? Stand up math by Matt Parker. Yep. So basically <coughs> You drew a pendulum. Yep. So this is about defining pi with a physical thing. Yeah, defining pi physically. Uh, I've actually got a. Uh, yeah, I mean, oh, you only try to do it physically. So the time that the. Uh, so basically, the time that a pendulum makes one total swing. Then, uh, that is, uh, 2 times pi times the square root of the length of the pendulum divided by the local gravity. That's the, that's it. Now, if you, so, um, on Earth, the local gravity, uh, is about 9.8. If you make the length a quarter of that, the square root of a quarter is a half. So, um, uh, let me show you the process here. Let's, so, then it goes 2 pi and the square root of, and, um, and then uh, it cancels down to a quarter. That fraction cancels down to a quarter. The square root of a quarter is a half. So that is going to be right square root of a quarter is a half. And a half cancels out with a two. And so I end up with pi. The time that I'm uh, a pendulum or the local gravity no, is equal to four times the uh, length it is gonna take uh, exactly pi seconds for the pendulum to make one complete swing which we almost got oh it was a rough estimate estimate yep <laughs> 
And this is just one of the many activities that you planned for Pi Day. <laughs> and um, we're on number five now, calculating Pi by... No, we're number four now, calculating Pi with the pendulum, which is written in yellow chalk, so you can't really read it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it just, I, I just put them in the order of the, 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 the chalks or in the box. So. <laughs> Thank you. The next, the next thing you're going to do is uh, calculate pi by weighing a circle and a square. So, uh... <laughs>